what's up people, Dobbs Rules is right here and welcome to another Yu-Gi-Oh! pack opening in the January month of my birthday month. Before we start, please check out Funky Figures. Funky Figures. Please check out their three stores right here, Berry, um, Warrington and Wigan. Check their social media out, give them a call saying that Dobbsy's, Dobbsy, Dobbsy recommended you and he'll help you out as much as they can. They will buy Pokemon cards and any pop figures. They will buy, sell or trade. They are working their hardest to try and get themselves into Pokemon, but at the minute, they're working on it. But today, we're opening up another booster box of Rush Jewel. Looks like three females possibly, or two females and a boy. Looks like a cool box and it's from Sevens, which is the new series. Nine packs, nine cards in the pack, 15 boot packs in the booster box. I paid 1920 yen for this box, so it's still quite a cheap box. But again, you can get some extremely expensive cards in these boost boxes. And people don't understand why I never might open them up. Because Rushul is actually a really, really ca cool card game. I love to learn it. But for God's sake, Konami, let us have it. Even if you only get it in the States, we'll play it in the UK. We'll just import them over here. It's the cool card concept, I really do like it. And it could possibly be a very fair of a game, for all I know. But, let's get these boost boxes open. Um, the the um, card list at the back, if you guys want to know, there is only 40 cards in this set. Looks like 18 commons, 12 rares, 6 supers, 3 ultras, and 1 god card. So, we would definitely want to go after that card, shall we people? But I could be wrong, like I said, I can't read Kanji, so it could be 18 holographics or reverses. We'll find out in a minute. So let's start up this opening. Right, common cards, that's all we need to know, so that's good to know. So let's have a look at what we can pull here. So we got ourselves a rare, okay. We're not putting the prices up for the rares, we're just going to be pricing up the foils if I can do, if I do find the actual value of them on the internet. Well, that's quite cute as well. Looks like some sort of bit young producer. Side frames, possibly? <laughs> Block attack, really? <laughs> Don't play this card if you're playing new, it, you know, modern Yu-Gi-Oh now, because this card is so bad. But possibly it's quite good in this Rush Duel game. Because like I said, you have to be fast in Rush Duel. You can't be a staller in modern Yu-Gi-Oh. That's one thing I probably stay away from in tournaments nowadays because a lot of people just love to stall. Oh, we got a holographic. That looks cool. It's like a skull on two wheels. <laughs> what is that? That is quite cool. I like that. 1500 attack, zero defense. It's quite a weak, weak monster, but it pays off with the, the way it looks. Awesome. So we got ourselves our first super rare and there's only um, six super rares in this set so they're a little bit hard to pull. Oh that is cute, that's adorable, it's like a sad rabbit, like watching two rabbits making mochi. Oh that's cute as well, little goat. Oh it's La Jin, a spell for La Jin, the mythical genie of the lamp. Ooh, I like the sound of that. Do, does it look like that large Jin is actually going to get them get himself new support? To be honest though, do we need large Jin to get support in the UK? Possibly not, unless they're going to turn him into an illusion monster. Which possibly they will do. That's a, is that like a Chimera? So possibly these cards that we're opening up right now are going to be consistent of these three characters' um, actual decks. So if you guys want to know, have I watched any of the anime or read the manga for the um, Yu-Gi-Oh! 7s? I've not seen a single bit of it. I've just seen the cards and they look absolutely amazing. Oh, we got an Ultra Rare! Look at that! Some sort of Incubus or some sort of Devil? Dude, this guy looks mint! He looks sick as hell! Sleeve that bad boy up. Some sort of incubus, succubus type of monster. He looks menacing as anything. 
This is our first ultra rare, and you only get three ultra rares in this set, so possibly that's the only ultra rare we can get in this booster box, so that is actually really, really darn good. Okay. Okay, some sort of sanctuary card. Let's have a looky. Oh, that's a Rookton special. We've got a Super Rare right here. Oh, wow, Pop Singers. That's cool. Well, there's our Super Rare right here. That looks nice as well. So we've got two Supers and one Ultra Rare. That is really, really good, I think. I'm going to be seeing a lot, a lot of commons now that we've seen a few times. That's a cool rare right here. Oh! Oh, baby! Is this what we were hoping to get? Is this the number one card? No, seriously not. So you got 18 comments, Wes? Yeah, boy, this could be the ace. This is the best card of the set. my let's fucking go. I was not expecting that. That must be the one card in the set that is the god card. That, my friends, is a freaking god pox. That is amazing. Let's freaking go. That could possibly be the most expensive card in the set. For all I know, I have no idea. But let's freaking go holy baby let's go oh you may be thinking why am i not ex superly excited i have no idea how much these cards are worth i really don't i'm still new to the rush jewels um you know crowd so i don't know but i think that's the most expensive card in the set for all i know i don't have a clue i really don't it could be the best card it could not be I don't know. I really don't. No. A Rockstar Girl. Woo. Jeez. Oh, wow. Mizaki. He's back. Nice. But there's the Super Rare right here. I think we've been getting some really good boxes from Japan, people. Damn. I actually picked some absolutely amazing ones back in March. God, think about that though, people. March, it's been almost a year since I was there. Jesus, people, it's been, it feels like I was only there yesterday. Boy, I miss it. Here we go, more. Let's have a look key. Another Ultra, you gotta be joking. This is a great box. Oh my goodness. That looks freaking sick. I love it. Final pack of Destiny. Can we end it off with a hollow? I don't think we need to, people. I think we did well. Two ultra rares, and there's only three in the box. Three in the set. That is freaking godly. Oh yeah, people. That is amazing. Holy mother of God. That was cool. So let's put the, the normal rares to the side, but let's have a look at the foils then. So yeah, you got two ultras, three supers, and possibly, if you're lucky, the god card. So here's the super rares that we pulled. And then there's our ultras, which this one looks the best, I think. And then you have this dude that looks absolutely insane. If you guys enjoyed today's episode, make sure you smash the like button, subscribe if you're new to the channel. Remember people, go ahead and check out Funky Figures. They are awesome, they help me out a lot, and they can help you out as well, as long as you ask for them. <sighs> and also, if you become a actual well-known regular, maybe you're lucky, you might get a little few discounts, if you're lucky, we don't know. With that being said, make sure you smash the like button, the people, sal people salami, the people salute goes to you guys for subscribing, and I'll see you guys next time. Cheerio! No freaking way I just pulled the best card in the box. That is awesome.
I like getting these. These are nice. I do have a couple of the volumes are, but I'm sure they'll pop up right now. Oh! Oh! 